that locally 25% of our local high schoolers have seriously considered attempting suicide. So we know that suicide prevention is a huge priority. Staff within a local school district focused on bringing down the numbers of youth suicide in the area. TV 5's Trey Harris gives us an inside look at the in-depth program giving school staff and students hope. We'd like to get these started early in the year so they're up and active, you know, right from hopefully the first month of the school year. Genesee Health System and Genesee Intermediate School District have partnered together to bring the Hope Squad, educating advisors within the district on peer-to-peer -peer suicide prevention training to pass down to a special group of students for the year. It's so important that we have a network of students who are looking out for each other and that are trained on how to convince their friend to come with them to get the important help that they need for their mental health. Hope Squad student members would be nominated by their peers, which is why the program's main focus is to bring down the number of youth suicide, specifically through peer intervention. The research says 7 out of 10 young people before they attempt suicide will tell a friend prior to their attempt. And we want that friend to be equipped. We want them to be skilled, to know exactly how to persuade that struggling friend or peer. They might not even know their name, but to come with them to a trusted adult. We know that locally 25% of our local high schoolers have seriously considered attempting suicide. So we know that suicide prevention is a huge priority and GHS has really welcomed this partnership with the Genesee Intermediate School District. And Stephen Tunnicliffe, superintendent for the Genesee Intermediate School District, believes more resources like the Hope Squad will soon be mainstays within schools. It's important for us to continue to add resources, especially around student mental health, um, with the hopes that, that obviously we can make it a difference in, in even one life. We're peer-to-peer because -peer we know kids talk to kids. And the whole idea is to create this trained, skilled network of eyes and ears in all, every school, hopefully, eventually, of, of students who know what to look for. In Genesee County, Trey Harris, WNEM TV5. The program will train a total of 12 schools. Six went through the training today, another six going through it tomorrow. If you are struggling with mental health or thinking about suicide, call 988 for help.